Good morning. Welcome to Vlogmas. I have literally never participated in Vlogmas ever. Don't get me wrong, I've wanted to, but every time that December comes around, I'm either really, really occupied with school or I am just not able to vlog um, and up edit a bunch of videos in time. So I've decided that this Vlogmas, I'm just, it's not gonna be formal, it's not gonna be, you know, Vlogmas number one, Vlogmas number two, Vlogmas number three. I really would have wanted to start on the 1st of December, but there's a lot been going on. I haven't been able to film. The last time that I filmed a bunch of videos was a few weeks ago, and um, that's what I've been uploading the past few weeks. This is still just going to be part of Vlogmas, I guess. We are doing a shower routine. I have not done a shower routine in so long. I was actually going through my videos and i'm like oh my gosh i haven't uploaded a shower routine since like probably september or october i'm not sure and it's just gonna be vlog style i am starting this from bed i woke up a couple of hours ago what is the time it is 7 12. i woke up probably at like 5 30 because my brother goes to school so he the bathroom is right next to my room and he just like sings and like makes noise in the morning so if i wake up at that time it's kind of hard for me to go back to sleep i've been awake ever since but i've just been laying in bed i went and i got some orange juice instead of water that should change in the new year right but yeah and i also slept in my tank top it's a really really pretty day out the sun is in full motion i'm gonna do a few things today i don't know if i'm gonna vlog those things but let's do a shower routine i can't believe i believe everything we have will last we don't get naive of me to she was from your past silly of me to So I just got out of the shower, feeling clean, squeaky clean and everything. Literally while I was in the shower, the water became warm and then it was like coming cold. And I don't know, it's so hot today, like it's boiling. It's been hot basically almost every single day. It's hot in Atlanta. When we shower, cold water was in like the end of the world. I just got out of the shower, so I'm just going to kind of narrate to you what I did in the shower, the products that I used. For my face care routine, you guys, I haven't really been doing much in the past, I'll say even like six months. Um, I haven't done much face care and I know that like the, the camera isn't gonna truly show you like my face texture right now, how my skin is actually doing right now. But honestly, this is, I think probably the best that my skin has been in a while just not doing too much i used to do a lot of skincare content on my channel on my instagram that time my skin was thriving i was doing like a lot of masks and just a lot of little treatments on my face i was making sure to do my skincare every single day if i just had like a bad reaction to a product i would stop using it and my skin gets really really dry really easily i already have dry skin and there's certain products that really dry out my skin so i just decided that okay i am just going to do dove on my face and that's it that is all i've been putting on my face for the past i don't know how many months almost six months maybe even longer i literally just use a dove beauty cream bar i use that on my face i wash my face so i do the whole washing your face for a minute thing though i can't i don't count but then it feels like a minute i make sure to really really wash my face and my neck baby you don't know what you do to me between me and you i feel like chemistry i won't let no one come and take your place because the love you give you can't be replaced so no I know that my skin can do better so definitely in the new year 
here I'm gonna try to sort of work on texture issues, work on my skin being dry and hyperpigmentation and stuff like that. This is not necessarily a skincare channel, it's a self-care channel. There's not a lot of people get that confused when they're saying, oh my friend has a skincare channel. No, this is it's not skincare, it's self-care. I'm more into the smell good products and the stuff that actually makes your body feel feel good you know i'm not so much into like the skincare yeah i'll definitely get back into that in the new year so you should look out for that i just really need really to go back to the drawing board and find out what products work for my skin so that's the only thing that i do for my face in the shower and then the next since this is a very simple routine there's no shaving there's no exfoliating it's literally just me cleaning my body i like to just use a brush so that's what i use in all of my skin body care routines just a brush soap. There are some days when I don't use body wash, shower gel, any of that. I just use brush soap. So the brush soap that I use is the Johnson's Blueberry Extract Bar Soap. At first, I thought that it was really gonna be like super fresh, fruity, and stuff like that. It is not. It's. It, it's not, there's, there's nothing special about it, but it does clean my skin really well and it's super creamy. That's what I really like in body wash products, soap products. It's really, really creamy. I despise things that dry up my skin, so I don't use them at all. Dove and Johnson's, you know what I mean? So in the bar soap category, I don't really use much as much these days. Today, you guys, it's not much, but I've actually finally learned that less is okay, and <laughs> I don't have to use so many products um, when I'm doing like my small good routines. Doesn't mean I'm gonna stop. I just don't have to do it all the time. But I need to know the real me. I'm not all tidy and polished all the time. My background is kind of messy right now because I'm actually sorting. I don't know if you can see that, 
but I'm sorting some of these things that were just kind of like lying around in the closets and on the bed so I just like put everything there and I'm still trying to sort them so please let's just ignore them let's pretend that they're not there so i'm gonna start with this deodorant this is the lintheria kwaiti twaiti deodorant it's if you um, are into lintheria kwaiti twaiti products then you've probably already seen this it's giving very much high school girl yes and this is i think i used to use something like this in high school i don't know if i can say that this is this it's a, the same exact product but i know that i definitely used to use something like this in high school and the lotion as well but they smell super girly um yeah it dries really nicely as well you definitely need a deodorant that dries nicely i have this habit of packing on so much deodorant i don't know what's wrong with me i've been using this body cream for quite a while now and it's so so nice very goodness body cream by also oh heavenly you know even if i try not to buy also oh heavenly i still buy it i'm still a stan all right so this has got um red berries rosewood vanilla caramel and sandalwood it's such a nice little like berry very sweet very fruity type of scent um i love sandalwood in products i love caramel in products and i love berries in products but i love oh, this stuff smells so good it's so sugary sweet creamy berries fruity type of situation but i also like the fact that it's quite thick because um those who have any body lotions are not thick at all i'm sure a lot of you guys who have watched my videos and actually went and purchased some of those who have any lotions or maybe you already just purchased them without watching my videos or whatever you guys have probably noted that they are not thick they're very thin they smell good but they're very thin and they just do not moisturize they just do not have that moisturizing element that body lotions should just have you know that's why we end up buying stuff like vaseline and nivea um products because then even if they just have like a simple smell they are actually moisturizing but the cream because it's a cream is much thicker and it does a much better job at moisturizing it definitely has that moisturizing element um yeah i love this stuff it makes me smell so good and the smell actually lingers on me for a while there was a day when i just took a shower and i just put on this body lotion this body cream nothing else i mean i put on my dress and i went to go chill in the lounge and my sister was like oh what did you spray you smell so good i'm like i literally sprayed nothing it's literally just this i don't know if i've seen any very goodness body mists by also heavenly but the problem is that with also heavenly the moment that you get to <sighs> body mist they're just not gonna last i have not been buying and using also heavenly body mist that much i know i'm about to use one but i haven't really been buying them that much because i'm just not into it like i'm not i'm not into the buying because i was a lot of the times that i would buy i would buy to collect but i'm not even that into buying to collect anymore because like it's not doing anything for me it's lasting on my clothes 20 minutes it lasts on my body 15 or 10 minutes like wh why should i keep on applying the product you know what i mean but now that we've talked about that let's let's talk about mermaid at heart fragrance mist but also heavenly this one has also got berries um and caramel just like this but then this one has peach instead of all the other stuff so it's red berries golden peach and caramel candies also i love mermaid at heart this is actually the old packaging i'm pretty sure my sister has the new packaging i'll definitely restock on mermaid at heart mainly because it's one of my favorites i yes even though i just like trash talk them i still do use their products like it doesn't mean that I, I completely stopped i just stopped buying them as much as i used to i know which ones last a little bit longer on the body and the ones that last longer on the body and the clothes are the very warm fruity ones like this um, mermaid at heart you also have golden glow that one lasts a little bit longer than the others vanilla fresh vanilla french vanilla lasts a little bit longer than the others um candy swirl also lasts a little bit longer than the others i've literally put all of my canned body sprays in a drawer and i've not been using them 
in ages. Maybe they shouldn't be in there. Maybe they shouldn't be in there. But anyway, um, also Love Blooms doesn't last as long on the body, but it does actually last on clothes. I've noticed. So yeah, um, as you can tell, that I'm kind of do. I'm kind of going with like a berry theme here. So this one is berry goodness, and this is Mermaid at Heart. It a little young but what i like about it is that it's a, got a huge age range i guess anybody who is 14 years old can use this if you're 21 you can use this if you're 30 you can use this you probably you know as old the older that you get you'll probably need to layer this with like a pop of perfume but if you're 15 you can use this and just this and then the last thing that i'm gonna use but i'm gonna spray this now on my body and then i'll spray it again on my clothes since i haven't actually decided what i'm gonna wear today i'm having a little we're having a little surprise party for my sister and my nephews, but she doesn't know about that. But yeah, we're having that, so I don't know what I'm gonna wear today. But whatever I actually end up wearing, I'm gonna spray this on it. This is the Burberry Her Perfume. This is the stuff that I take everywhere. It's got like jam-packed with um, berry notes. So I think there's a strawberry note in here, a blackberry note in here, an amber note in here. So yeah, the whole routine is basically just like very, 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 very scented. I am obsessed with Burberry Hair. The projection isn't great. The lasting power isn't great, but I just really, really love my Burberry Hair. I'm obsessed with this stuff, as you can see. I don't usually let perfumes go down this quickly. I've literally only had this for maybe uh, just under two months. I'm obsessed, you guys don't even understand, obsessed with Burberry hair. And I'll just spray this on my body now and then I'll put on my outfit after this video. I'll, I'll just try to find something to wear and I'll spray it on there as well. But I will layer it with Mermaid at Heart, so it's all good. I smell so nice right now. I smell so yummy. But there's something about berry. Um, at some point I was saying that I don't want to buy fruity products anymore because I was like, oh, they make me smell young. But I don't think I'm all that worried about it anymore because then I do have perfumes, like proper perfumes that I can layer over them that will not make me smell young. So I can just have my fun with the young products like Mermaid at Heart. Literally Mermaid at Heart is, is for teenage girls basically. But yeah, we can still use it. And yeah so that is the end of the video it's been so long since i've done a shower routine slash body care smell good layering routine i i'm obsessed with how i smell right now i smell so so good right now and i can't wait to just put on my outfit spray the perfume put on some hoops and go to this party i'm really excited if you haven't already please don't forget to give it a thumbs up let us chat in the comments and i will see you guys in my next video bye baby you don't know what you do to me between me and you i feel like chemistry i won't let no one come and take your place because the love you give you can't be replaced